Hi guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to take apart the iPhone 4S and replace the screen. To get started, go ahead and remove your SIM tray. Next, go ahead and remove the two screws from the bottom. This will allow you to slide back and then lift up the back plate. Next to remove the battery, there are simply two screws holding the connector in place. Remove the two screws and you can use your fingernail or a plastic pry tool to simply lift up the connector. Once you have it disconnected, go ahead and pull on the tab to remove the battery. I find it should pop out easy enough. Next go ahead and remove the two screws for the cover of the dock connector cable. Next, I'm just going to go ahead and use this plastic pry tool to disconnect it. Now go ahead and peel back the cable. Be careful not to apply too much force and break it. Now to remove the microphone and speaker assembly. There are two screws either side. Simply remove these. There is still an antenna cable connected. I'm just going to go ahead and use my nail and simply disconnect it. Once I've disconnected it, the whole assembly should just come right out. Next I'm going to go ahead and use this flathead screwdriver to remove the second part of the screw. In the iPhone 4S, there are two of these screws. The one with the shorter base is the one at the bottom. There are five screws holding the cover in place for the top part on the main logic board. Go ahead and remove these. Place them in order according to the way you take them off. I find this is the best way and the easiest way to keep track of them. Now to remove the cover. I find you should push it up as there are tabs holding it in place. Then you can pull it back down on itself and it should come out. If you find it is getting caught, make sure you do not pull too hard as you could damage some of the cables. Next you can go ahead and use your nail to simply disconnect the connectors on the top of the logic board. The connector relative to the bottom of the camera is holding the camera in place. Simply disconnect that and the camera should just come right out. Next I'm going to use this flathead screwdriver to remove the second part of the screw. Next, there's a little screw at the top left hand corner of the logic board, hidden under some black tape. Once you've removed this tape, Take note that you are avoiding your warranty.
there is still one screw located by the vibrator at the bottom of the logic board. Go ahead and remove that. There is still an antenna cable attached at the top right hand side of the logic board. Make sure you remove this. Once you've everything disconnected, you can go ahead and take out the main logic board. Next go ahead and remove the vibrator module. It is necessary to do this to gain access to all of the screws. I'm just going to use this plastic pry tool to just slip it out of place. Now to remove the four screws in each corner of the device. These screws hold the screen in place. One of these screws has more of this black warranty tape. Remove this before removing the screw. Once you've removed the screws from each of the four corners, there are six screws remaining, three along each side. It is only necessary to give these screws maybe one twist to loosen them so the screen can slide out. Next, I'm going to use this utility knife to remove the screen, as it is still held in with some adhesive. One thing I've noticed and would like to point out is, when you're using the knife over the proximity sensor area, which is just above the microphone, there is a little spacer which can sometimes be moved or removed. This will stop the function of the proximity sensor, so be careful when using your knife. If you would like any advice in relation to this video or purchasing parts for your device, please feel free to ask me. Make sure, if you're replacing the screen, to remove the spacer for the front-facing camera and the mesh for the microphone. If you found this video helpful, visit my channel for related videos. Comment, rate, subscribe, or visit the iPhonefella.com for all your jailbreaking, unlocking, and iOS needs.